Just a quick little tip. Yeah, no, not really so much a tutorial. After I uploaded my config, I noticed there was a little problem. You know, so uh, on the left pad, like, by default, I'm using grip for jump. But just for this, I'm going to show you, like, we can also jump on the left pad up. But what happens is, while you're in your aim mode, see, I'm pushing up. I can't jump. And that was, uh, that was bugging me. And that's a super easy little fix. So, like I said, I am using the right grip for jump. So I did not apply this to the, to over here. I mean, we could, but we'll get to that. All I did, gave it a mode shift, right grip, to a single button, which is empty. So now, I'm aiming. I can aim and jump, and then it goes right back to my aiming as soon as I, you know, as soon as I let go of the grip, I'm back to my aim. You know, a little tip and kind of, uh, I often get asked, like, how do I approach it? Like, the, uh, the thought process behind it. And this is really getting to the idea of what you're having buttons not do instead of mapping them to specific functions. And this is something that I've gone over with uh, Corded Press. I did a video with, I think that was in Interstellar Marines, where that one had, it was kind of the same thing. It was aiming down sights, but then in that it's a first person shooter. And if you were aiming down sight and I had sprint on outer edge, it would lurch you out of out of your uh, aiming. And that was as simple as giving a corded press to that outer edge binding to be empty when I was holding my aim. So it's really the same approach. I just kind of wanted to bring that back in a quick little tip just, you know, to really get you to start thinking less about just the specific functions that you're mapping and that's really, a, that's a huge strength to Steam input, even compared to, like, other mappers that I've used, that you can cancel actions. So yeah, that made a huge difference. So now I can aim, cancels that aim so I can jump. Now, like I was mentioning, what about, what about this, uh, up over here? So for that... That, I wasn't really too... I mean, that's actually not in my uploaded version, and I'm not too concerned about it, because I'm always using the grip. But just as an example, so if we wanted to do this... Uh, like, for this particular one, yeah, I think I would go... Like, in this particular approach, I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to go with a an action layer. So on this action layer, I would take... Uh, I would probably do the same thing. Just make this... Make it a single button. With an empty binding. And then, make this... Uh, let's give it another regular press. Apply. Apply jump. I don't want it to... Whip, whip, get that mouse out of the way. Don't want it to beep. The regular press, apply action layer, jump. Yeah, actually, take that off. So apply action layer jump. On jump, have this be... Jump, and then... Release press. Remove, jump. Let's take that off. It's all right, we'll see how that works. Yeah. So there you go. I mean, that's three different ways. I mean, I'm showing you two, but I'm telling you, you know, there's that other one from Interstellar Marines. I'll link to that in the description where I use a corded press. But yeah, this is using a mode press or mode shift. 
or an action layer and is giving you more control than the default controls of the game have. So, you know, just always be aware and be thinking that if you're frustrated with something that's happening in the game, sometimes you can figure out little workarounds. It's less about what you're having the buttons do and more about what you can make them cancel doing. And really, like, I'm gonna say it again, that does seem to be a fairly unique strength to Steam input. At least in my experience. But yeah, that's it. Quick, simple little thing. I just wanted to bring that up. Don't forget, you can fix things. You can tweak them. Cancel out actions. Woo! So I can jump like a crazy fool. And then go right back to aiming. Copy hot dispatch. Perfect. Couldn't have said it better myself. Copy that dispatch. Which I just did. Because I kind of wanted to say, Alright, I will see you around.